Today, we did our part to help return oysters to the Chesapeake Bay at the Oyster Restoration Center in Shadyside, Maryland. Volunteers took part in shell shaking. So I'm doing my senior project with the Chesapeake Bay Foundation, and today we came here and shook oyster shells, and then they're gonna um, use that to grow some baby oysters and put them back in the bay. These clean, shell-filled baskets are used to build restoration reefs. Today, we packed about 20 with recycled oysters from locations around Maryland. It took a half hour to fill each one. From here, the baskets will be submerged into large vats of bay water to be used as a base in producing juvenile oysters, called spat. It used to be believed that old oyster shells were useless, but we now know baby oysters grow on the Old Oyster Shell Foundation. Here we are at Chesapeake Bay Foundation's Oyster Center filling cages with shell. And each shovel of shell is equal to about 200 spat. Once grown, the spat is moved onto a specially designed 60-foot boat called the Patricia Campbell and brought to protected sanctuary reefs throughout Maryland waters. These locations are carefully selected by teams of scientists from the University of Maryland and are believed to have the best conditions for the oyster reefs to grow. Want to do your part? Visit the Chesapeake Bay Foundation's website for volunteer days at the Oyster Restoration Center. Collect oyster shells in your community and bring them to the center. And support restaurants that are a part of oyster recycling programs that support the bay. That's a lot of oysters. <laughs> Save the bay!